rock and roll. Chuck rock, baby. All right, first things first. Um, how well, I'm supposed to press pop jams and... Oh my god, that's just move. Using his belly. Or the power of pumping. Okay. First of all... All the caveman games I ever played. I don't think I ever played this one. Chuck Rock. I do have a sequel, but it's about a kid. The son of Chuck Rock. Also that word, Unga Bunga, is like the same line from Mel Brooks, but did Captain Caveman from that cartoon, Flintstone Kid. Sadly, the actor who played on um, Hesley in 1990, that played, um, They're safely for the final time in the Jensen's movie, which I'll get to another time. I've got these weird looking reptiles. Also, how am I supposed to hit that enemy? Oh, he just jumps and kicks. I like the music, it sounds very interesting. on the dinosaur. It's kind of weird that they had to put this game on Super Nintendo as well, and Sega CD. All they love is react when they take damage. Yeah, you stuff this pterodactyl. See. Alright, press down. Grab the rock to see I can drop on the enemy. Awesome. Um, okay, and don't take fall damage, which is good. I'm only gonna play this game for a short while. I found some downloading, it's gonna be like close to 10 o'clock. Get it, cause I already said play for like 10 minutes and I, it's gonna be like close to 10 o'clock. I think this game does have like a story plot that you're playing Chuck Rock. Okay, then I see those plants there. He has to save his girlfriend from the evil T Rex character. So it's up to you to save her. And he thinks to her death. But yeah, here. Now we got two lines left. This is gonna be a short gameplay, isn't it? I don't usually play caveman video games, but this is actually not too bad. Also, how am I supposed to reach that? There. Not much else to say about this game. There's just actually is and our main antagonist hero is to make six to these levels about Diane. Ow. And use like a pair of that built to assess them to the other side. I like that. The graphics don't look that bad. This game came out so long ago. Alright, that was a waste. I 
I do like the weird looking enemies in this game besides the T Rex. I mean, dinosaurs. I'm pretty sure you say like. Like underwater enemies, and most likely, um. Ones are. How many jellyfishes are squids? Get out of here. Let's see. Yep, I thought so. More rain rock. Alright, one, two, three, pro. How am I supposed to know you're going to come this way? Thank you for my foot. I can't believe that there's only a belly. There's a belly as a weapon. Wow, that thing was gonna eat me. What the was with the pig head there? Yeah, get out of here. Okay, there's too many enemies. And he's dead. Okay, I got one life left. That was not much else to say, but the backgrounds look pretty neat. Okay, you can't hit the rocks there. Ow. Wait a minute. Also, I thought food would give you health. Not high scores. Not that anybody cares about high scores now. I think the only way you're going to get that item is to use this boulder as a platform. Right, I got it. Like any video game. If you die, you are back to the beginning. No save points, no nothing. That. Have some of this. Okay, screw off. Get up there. I'm so bad. Got one hit left. Probably not gonna make it. Oh, we both die at the same time. Now we got zero lines. Kinda cool that I can... Also, destroying the born ones. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to climb up. I 
Oh, I see. It's a. It's like a seesaw. So. Hold on. Now let's try again. Rabbit. See. I'm trying to figure out how these controls work. Here we go. I don't think I'm gonna make it because I got the hero lines now. I don't like the account, but this is a sound effect for you to use it. The Paragato. Another one. Yeah, I hear. A pig head is mine. I don't know why he would fight some pig head off like that. That might be that movie. He's up in Scarface. I'm pretty sure they did that. In one of those movies, like the person's head off and her like really drops in bed, and there's like the head there that's kind of freaky. Anyone remember that movie? No? Okay, let me use the tall rock. I'm trying not to screw this up. I pause the game. One of my eyes, because I still got the set my eyes. Okay, so you can step on them. The animal. Why does that egg look like it's made out of metal or just stone? There we go. We have to use some sort of boulders to get to the top. I'm almost dead. Really, this counts as a boss. Good, the game gives you like turns and option to continue. Okay, I have to get the hand with the rock. I'm trying to figure out what the controllers work. Alright, here we go. Try that again. Alright. Oh, got him. Alright, we might be a Super Mario Bros. 2. He said, I have a caveman doing that ridiculous move there. Alright, got him. He's just running back and forth. Alright, alright, he almost got me there. 
I just it looks like a pretty easy battle. Alright. I think he has been like four times. I don't know. I never played this game before. And you expect. Okay, that's four. This is such an easy battle. Five. Wrong button. Six. This is such an easy battle. Alright, kill this guy and I'll end it here. Seven. Yes, I did it. I beat the boss. Level one clear. Okay, now we're in a cave. Also, is that a freaking seahorse? And a porcupine. Right, this got even weirder. I don't even know what that is. There's like a sign over the white bath. Can I hit this guy? Nope. Apparently that mod monster is invisible. Alright, if I die one more time, I'm gonna end it here. Also, that's supposed to be a spider. So there was like a big on the map. Okay, that's a snake. This thing is a platform. Those are like the Flintstones. Ow. Alright, the key level doesn't look that bad, actually. So we're swarming with enemies. Ow. I think that's a bulky admirer, but he looks too goofy looking. He's like a jamming man. Right now, it's a deal with Earthquake. And I die in the fire. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. I know we're not 20 minutes in, but I'm done. I think I cleaned up games for today. So I treat this weird looking one. So that was Chuck Rock. I mean, this game is not half bad. The controls have to get used to. Ooh. Now, how to control him pretty well is actually not too bad. Dumping does work well. You have to press down, press the action button to pick up things and lift them up and tell them to time or follow them at enemies. That's pretty much all you do in this game, so yeah. If you have to see like several levels and bosses, so are actually pretty easy. I've seen this game before, so yeah. If you want to play an old new card game, this will be for you. Alright, have a great time. I'll see you all all in the next video. Alright. Have a great time, everyone. See ya.